Today we are at Castle Gate Erasmus Park in Pretoria. I'm Jakob Pretorius, I'm an architect at Burgertman and Partners. I am the design architect for Castle Gate Retail and the design and project architect for Castle Gate Offices. Burgertman and Partners has projects throughout Africa and the UK and embraces social, economic and functional design through sustainability and has a large range of typologies in its portfolio. The brief asked for a 20,000 square meter um, shopping center that was easily accessible and um, had, uh, enough parking to sustain the amount of people that would eventually come to the center. The center houses a unique mix of restaurants, retail, and has a green heart at its center, which is used as a dining square or dining piazza. This green park-like heart visually connects the reserve where the Arpis River is on, in the south, and then to the north, it connects to the market through the square. How the spaces in between typologies are utilized are just as important. Parks and lobbies need to accommodate all the typologies existing around that space, creating exciting nodes that involve social dynamics. The architecture of this building is a mix between industrial and farm style. Both buildings have several different brick bonds or patterns that we use on the facades, and this gave us lots of opportunity for detailing in the design. One of the features um, on the building is the, the tower, um, and we did a Flemish bond on the tower where we left out or left empty spaces where the Flemish bond would connect between bricks. The tower mimics an old industrial brick chimney from a brick factory, and that is what we wanted to portray um, as part of the uh, uh, industrial feel of the site. We, we made use of face brick, um, not just for its functionality um, when it comes to uh, low maintenance, but we used it because of its natural beauty that it has. The brick that we chose for the retail center is Country Manor Travertine, and for the offices we chose Brutia Travertine. Brutia Travertine we chose because of its uh, consistency and its copper undertone that it has. The office and gym building had to be 6,000 square meters and had to contain 3,300 squares of three-story offices and a 2,700 meter square gym. Another main feature on the office building is its large overhang which provides shade in the summer but is high enough to let in enough sun in the winter. We chose Corabrick because it was readily available and the site closest to us was the Ritflay factory that is about 17 kilometers away which saved on cost and our carbon footprint. There really is no brick like Corabrick. 